360 Payments and Protractor have partnered to provide you access to industry-leading consumer finance lenders from within your Protractor software. In this video, we're going to take a look at how to process a synchrony transaction when a customer has an existing account. Once on an open work order, you'll see a financing button in the general tab of your menu bar. If you see a green check mark on that button, the system has already found the customer's synchrony account. If you click that button, you'll see a pop-up window that shows you the amount of available financing. If the account had not been found, the button would have shown a red minus sign instead of the check mark. In this case, clicking on the button would have brought us to the same pop-up where we can select the correct phone number from a drop-down list of available numbers. To appear on this list, the number must be on the customer record and so might need to be added if it's not already there. Once you're ready to collect payment, you'll proceed as with any other payment by clicking Post. Resolve any dialog boxes in order to get to the payment screen. Once on the payment screen, you'll choose Consumer Financing as your payment method. Below the total, you'll again see the amount of available financing and the phone number for the account. The amount can be set to any amount up to the work order total or the available financing, whichever is lower. Click Add and then OK. The system will show you its processing and the message will update once it's approved. It'll show you the authorization number and give you the option to go to the online receipt, which will open up in a new browser and can be printed in order to collect a wet signature. And that's how you process a synchrony transaction to an existing account in CFP with your 360 Protractor integration.